Another lesson for Louie. Today, Louie's going to start learning how to do healing and sitting, and we're going to start this indoors. I always prefer to start it indoors because there's hardly any distractions. With heal and sit, what are the outcomes I'm looking for? One, healing, you teach the dog to walk on the left. That's easy to remember if I tell you a little story. The fathers of dog training were really military men and hunters, and they always wanted the dog on the left because they had the gun on the right. So that's how healing began on the left. Now, there's lots of reasons to teach a dog to walk both on the left as well as the right, especially if you're doing agility training. They need to be comfortable on both sides. And that's something you can easily move into, but today we're going to start with one side, we're going to start with the left side, and the word we're going to use is heel. Louie's partner, Lola, is over here tethered on the side, and she's going to be doing this shortly after Louie is. So we're training two dogs, and Lola, you're waiting really, really nice. So healing's on the left. The equipment we've got on Louie and Lola today, we're starting with just the martingale. And again, this is a training collar. And the distinction between a training collar and his permanent collar, or his ID collar, is that you have the quick release action. And I'm just going to step on that leash for a minute. But I have this quick release action. So, when the dog puts pressure on the collar in any direction, I have a way of communicating, you know, to release the pressure. So, if he went to pull on me, I can communicate. No, nope, you don't want to put pressure on the collar. With healing, I'm teaching him to walk on my left, and I'm also teaching him to walk on a loose leash. So, typically, this is going to require some kind of training collar for most dogs. Since we're just indoors, oftentimes you can get away with a regular permanent collar as well. But we're going to start with the martingale today. Now, there are some particulars that make healing easy. I like this example. I'd say, you know, if you danced with a great dancer, you feel like a great dancer. If you dance with someone that's awkward, it's just awkward. So teaching him to heal is more about using my movement and good leadership. So for a lot of people, this is like learning a new dance. In the dance, when I want my dog to move in obedience, I always say their name first. So what you're going to hear me say is I'm going to say, Louie, heal. The reason we say their name first is their name is referred to as a preparatory command. It prepares them to move. If, you heard, if someone was in a race, you know, they might hear one, two, three, and that countdown lets them move on go. So the one, two, three prepares a person to move. Their name prepares them to move in obedience. In obedience, we want to see the dog move on heel. We want to see him move on come. So I say his name first. And just jumping ahead a little bit, when I later on, when you tell the dog to stay, a static command, then you wouldn't use their name. The other thing that's going to make it clear for Louie is when I want him to heal, I'm going to lead off with my left leg. Well, what's the value in that? That left leg is right next to his head, so the dog kind of learns when this leg goes, I hear my name. That leg goes, I go. I don't hear my name. The other leg moves out. I stay. So having a difference there helps them distinguish whether they should go with you or not. One more time, I always say his name before I take off. I move on the word heel, and I lead off with the left foot. Now, if you, like most of my customers, they really have to think about that. They have to think about it initially, but like any conditioned response, if you discipline yourself for a little bit, soon you'll be able to do that without even thinking. 
The next thing I'm going to tell you in advance, you're going to see me going clockwise in the beginning, and to make this easy for Louie, I'm going to be using the wall. The wall is going to help us by helping him sit straight. Louie, finally. Louie does not have to be in a perfect position to begin, but when I slow down to stop, I'm going to want him at my left. Louie, heel. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So all of this jumping and stuff like that, Louie's just going to find it doesn't work. I have a treat in my hand, and he wants it. Good boy, good boy. Heel. Good. And sit. Turn so you can see this one. Good sit. But I need you over here. Sit. Great. I didn't use the leash to pull him over there. I used my movement to move him. So he's all wound up in the beginning here, and that's fine. I like to remember people, to remind people that the dog learns as much from his mistakes as he does his successes. So all of his leaping and stuff like that, I'm just being very patient. And he's just going to find out it doesn't pay. Lola, Lola, you're waiting. I know, Lola. I'm going to give Lola a little treat over here on the side. Good girl, Lola. Now, Louie is determined to just jump, so I might do this. I might just drop that leash, step on it a second. Right. In, in which case, he corrects himself when he jumps up. Good job, Louie. Good job. Nice, nice sitting. Yeah, you're sitting. Good job. Good boy, Louie. Good sit. Good sit. Good sit. That was very good. Very good. Slowly, you're waiting. I know, honey. Yeah, you're waiting. So my voice, I try to keep my voice nice and calm. Okay, Louie, heel. Good boy, heel. Heel. So what he's getting, he's getting this jackpot. Good. Good boy, Louie. Good boy. Good. Yeah. Long. You know, we're not going to teach Louie to not jump, but Louie could learn when the leash goes on and the training collar goes on. Sit. We're working. Good. Louie, heel. Wrong. Wrong. Good. Good. 
Good, Louie. Good. Louie, heal. Wrong. Wrong. Good. Good, Louie. Good. Good, Louie. Good. Good boy, Louie. Heal. Yeah, you're just walking with me. Heal. Good heal, Louie. Good heal. Heal. Yeah, heal. So I'm just trying to press this little head into my leg. Good boy, Louie. Huh? Lucky dog. Louie. Louie. One of the keys here is that I keep my eye on where I want to end up. Good. Good. Wrong. Wrong. Good. Good, Louie. Wrong. Louie. Heal. Good, Louie. Good. Up there. Louie, heal. Good, Louie. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Go around. Around. Wrong. Wrong. Good, Louie. Good, 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 good. Wrong. Wrong. Good. Good. Louis, heal. Wrong. Nice. Nice. Wrong. Nice, Louis. Very nice. Heal. Nice. Sit. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, Miss Lola. We need to go notice Lola for a second here. Lola, you're waiting. Good waiting, Lola. Good waiting. Lola. Good. Louie. Louie. Yeah. Lola. Good. Louie. Good. Good dogs. Good dogs. Good. There we go again. Ready? Here we go. Sit. Good. Louie, heel. Heel. Wrong. Good boy. Wrong. Sit. So I slow down to stop. And I'm trying to stop when he's exactly where I want him, which is his toes even with mine. Louie, heel. Good. Sit. Nice. Nice. Louie, heel. Lola, I hope you're learning from watching over there. Good. Better. Wrong. Good. Good boy. Good, good, good. Sit. Nice. Louie, heel. Good. Sit. Good. 
good. Louie, heal. Sit. Nice. Louie, heal. Heal. Good. Good. Sit. Good. Louie, heal. Sit. Thank you. Louie, heal. Sit. Nice. Very nice. Very nice, Louie. Good heal. Good sit. You have to heal and sit. Good boy, Louie. Good boy. Lola. Lola, you are waiting. Thank you, Lola. Good waiting. Yep. Good. Good waiting, Lola. Good waiting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Lola. Good. Louie. Lola. Louie. Good. Go a little more. Got a little more food. Nice sit. Nice sit. Nice. Sit. Good sit. L Louis, heel. Wrong. Wrong. Heel. Now he's wanting to walk a little too far in front of me. That happens when you're only going clockwise. But at least he's walking. Good. You know, for a moment there, I honestly thought about, golly, is using food even a good idea with him? Because, you know, it so inspired him to just jump and jump and jump. But this little guy's got a lot of tenacity. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Louis, heel. Good. If I wanted to start working on teaching him not to walk as far in front, I've got to go counterclockwise, making left turns. Good job. And I think we might do that for a minute, but I'm going to start by giving him a moment break. And I'm going to give Lola a second break. So we're going to come back right after the break. Lola. We're rolling. So next, we're going to give Lola a chance doing the same thing. Heel and sit, using the wall, and just starting by going clockwise. Lola, heel. Good girl, Lola. Sit. Nice. And you can see how that wall helps her sit nice and straight. Lola, heel. Good. Good. And I'm slowing down to stop, but I'm not going to stop till she's winner. I want her there. There. Lola, heel. Over here. Are you watching? Nice. So the food's in the left hand when you're using food. And when I go to feed her, I try to get my hand right in front of her nose. When I go to stop, if my hand was 
here, all the more reason I'm going to turn the dog that direction. I'm just going to make a right about turn and let you watch that again. Lola, heel. So I use my left hand to help guide her. And just before I stop, I get the left hand where I'd like her nose to be. Good girl, Lola. Good heel. Lola, heel. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Good, Lola. Heel. Heel. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You know, and this reminds me of, I have known of people where, oh, backing up a little bit, a lot of different roads can lead to the same destination. And I've known trainers that try to teach people to just hold the leash tight and just hold the dog there on your left as if that teaches them how to stay on their left. And the truth is, it's in learning that that's wrong, this is good, that's wrong, this is good, going behind me is wrong, this is good. It's letting them make the mistakes that I think that they really learn where the heel position is. So I'm purposely, no, I'm not just holding her there. And that method, you can hold them there, but as soon as you quit holding them, then they're going to be everywhere else. Lola, heel. Nice. Heel. So the method I'm teaching you is we let the dog make their mistakes. Using the clicker, I'm clicking when she ends up in the right position. and hoping that she you know, identifies with a clicker and she hears that noise, and that gives her some information as far as what I'm trying to accomplish. Louie, Louie, you're waiting. Not easy, Louie. Good waiting, Louie. Yeah. Good waiting. Louie. Yeah, Louie. Louie. We haven't forgot you. You're over here waiting. Good boy, Louie. Good boy. Okay. Lola. Heel. Good girl, Lola. Good sit. Good girl, Lola. Lola, heel. Good. Wrong. 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 Good, Lola. Good. Lola, heel. Good, Lola. Uh oh. Uh oh. Good Lola. Good Lola. Heel. Good Lola. Good Lola. Good. Yeah, much better. Much better, Lola. Heel and sit. Yeah. Nice, Lola. Very nice. Lola, heel. Good, Lola. Good, Lola. Heel. Nice. And sit. Nice. Nice. Lola, heel. Good, Lola. Uh-oh. Uh oh. Good, honey. 
and sit. So when I was healing with her, you see me try to reward her when she stops and sits, but I was also trying to reward her just as she was walking. Good waiting, Louie. Yeah, you're being very patient. Good boy. So now with Lola, I am going to try to go the opposite direction. And left turns, left turns are actually a little harder, but it's those left turns in front of them that teach them to uh, cut them back a little bit so they aren't so f out in front of you. You know, and, and I know you've noticed that she gets, she jumps up, she gets that cot under her leg, and I'm not too quick to fix it. I don't want, I want it to be a little unpleasant for her so that hopefully she decides jumping up isn't as much fun as she thinks. Lola. Lola, heel. So now we're going to go to the left. I just get moving. And I use my legs to kind of claim my space. Heel. Good, good, good. Good, Lola. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Good, Lola. Good, good, good. Nope. Heel. Good. Very good. Heel. Uh-oh. 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 Heel. Good, Lola. Uh-oh. 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 Lola, heel. Good. Good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Good. 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 Heel. Fix it, Lola. Lola, heel. Good, Lola. Good. Heel. Nice, 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 nice. Lola, heel. Good girl, good girl. Heel. Uh oh, uh oh. Lola, heel. Good. Nope. Heel. Good girl. Uh-oh. 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 Good girl, Lola. Good girl. Heel. We well, gotta fix it, Lola. Good. Heel. Good girl, Lola. Good girl. Heel. Good, good, good. Good girl. Lola, heel. Nice. Nice. Very nice, Lola. Very nice. Heel. Heel. Good. Heel. Lola, heel. Good, good, Lola. Heel. Good, heel. Good, and sit. Nice. Lola, heel, and sit. Good. Those left turns. You know, Lola's my little partner here, and I need to communicate to her that I'm going to make a left turn. The way I like to do it, Lola, could you get back over here? Just if, like, if you were driving, you would signal someone that you're going to make a left turn. 
her signal, it's going to become more clear in a moment, but her signal is she's at my left, and just before I make that left turn, I try to bring the leash over so it's kind of in her peripheral vision. So she sees that leash just before I make a left turn. Lola, heel. So I signal, and I turn. Lola, heel. Good girl. Good girl. Nice. Signal. Heel. Good. 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 Lola, heel. Signal. Turn. Signal. Turn. Sit. Good. Good girl, Lola. Good girl. Lola, heel. Good. Good. Sit. Nice, Lola. Good heel. Good heel, Lola. Good heel. Yeah. Lola, heel. Signal. Legs. Claim my space. Turn. Good. Signal. Turn. Good. Good. Good, Lola. Good. Sit. Nice. Nice, Lola. Good girl. Good girl. Okay. Okay. Last off, I'm going to do a little clockwise, counterclockwise. Louie, you have to wait. Really? You're just being too wild over here. Quiet. You need to be quiet. You have to sit and you have to wait. I know it's not easy. Life's not easy. Always. All right, so here, grand finale. Ready, Lola? For today. Now, you know what? Final point. I'm here working with Lola, trying to get the idea across to Lola. And for her owner, I always tell him, you know what? I'm a bad example. You're not going to work her this long. I'm their trainer. So I'm trying to get the idea across to Lola. When they go home, I just want them to do it for like 10 minutes, just clockwise. A few steps, stop. Walk, stop, sit. She does well, quit. Today, today was the hardest because I'm trying to get the idea across to them initially. But usually, you know, once I've got the idea across to the dog, then yes, the owner just reinforces it for a few minutes. So starting out again, lead off of the left foot, name first. Lola, heel. Beautiful, Lola. Yeah. And sit. There's where I do like the food. It contributes to getting her to look up at me. Lola, heel. Nice. And that's the presentation I want. Healing is, you're supposed to be looking at me. We're working. If I walk, you walk. If I slow down and stop, you sit. It's a dance. We're together. Lola, heel. Good. Heel, using that left hand, signaling her that I'm going to be turning left, helping her with the left hand, straighten up. Good sit, Lola. Lola, heel. Good. Good, Lola. Good. Uh-oh. 
Nice, Lola. Nice. Lola, heel. Heel. Good girl. Heel. Very nice. Very nice. Heel. And sit. Good. Good girl. Good boy, Louie. Good, quiet. You're waiting and you're quiet. Good boy. So, sorry, you've been hearing Louie in the background over there. And um, I couldn't exactly go over and give him a treat until now. Lola, heel. Good. Good. And sit. Having a hard time getting her to sit straight. It's all in that left hand. Good. Lola, heel. Beautiful. And sit. Nice. Lola, heel. Nice. Beautiful, Lola. Heel. Very good. Very good. No, 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 no. Nice, Lola. Heel. Sit. Sit, Lola. Sit. Sit. We're finished for today. Sit. All right. Here we go. Louie, we're going to go clockwise for a minute. Louie, heel. Good, Louie. Good. Louie, heel. Good boy, Louie. Good boy, Louie. Good boy. Good boy, Louie. Nice sit, Louie. Nice sit. That was very good. That was very good. Quiet. Lola, you have to wait. You've had your turn. You need to wait. You know, what I'm doing on the side here, as far as t having one watch while I work the other one, you know, one person might say, oh, wouldn't it just be easier to just put her outside while you're training him? Yeah, it might seem like it's easier. I might avoid this altogether, but really, that's not my final outcome. My final outcome, I want, if I have two dogs, I want one that can wait on its spot, and understand that it's not its turn, right? It's very hard for a dog to get to comprehend that, that really I have a turn. And especially these two, you know, they're like one at home. And you talk to one and they think you're talking to both of them. It's important and this is a great way to teach them, you know what, it's Louie's turn, okay now Lola, it's your turn. And you have to wait your turn and to teach them some patience. I think, if anything, that demonstrated today, too, with his tenacity, is how impatient, right? He wanted the food, and he wanted it then, and he wasn't going to try to think about, what did I want him to do to get the food? Shh! You have to be quiet. Good, quiet, Lola. Good, quiet. You have to wait. Yeah, you're waiting. You, they let, need to learn to wait. They need to be able to be patient. And their turn will come. Okay. Louie, heel. Heel. Good boy, Louie. Good boy. Sit. Nice. Louie, heel. Sit. Very good, Louie. Very good. Louie, heel. Good. Sit. Very nice. Louie, heel. 
sit. Very nice. Is that a little squirt for whining? Louie, heel. I'm going to try the left turns with Louie, signaling that I'm making a left turn. <coughs> nice. Heel. Good, 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 good. And sit. Good. Louis, heel. So now I'm using my legs, and I'm telling you the day comes, you will have your legs even off leash when you have no leash on the dog. You can still kind of claim your space. Sit. Nice. Louie, heel. Good. Wrong. Heel. Heel. Good, good, good. Uh oh. Good, good. Louie, heel. Wrong. 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 Louie, heel. Excuse me. Yeah, good, good, good. Yeah, 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 Louie, that's it, that's it. Louie, heel. Good. No. Nope. Good. Good boy, Louie. Good boy, Louie. Good heel. Good heel, Louie. Good heel. Lola. Sit. Just sit. Good girl, Lola. You just sit. Just sit, Lola. Wait. Louie, heel. Come on, Louie. Nice. Heel. Uh oh. Uh oh. Good. Yeah, good, Louie. And sit. Nice. Louie, heel. Heel. Uh-uh. Yeah, good, good, good. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Good. Good. Heel. Good. Heel. Good. Heel. Good. Good. Heel. Good. Good, Louie. Good. Very good. Very good. Heel. Good. Good. Heel. Good, Louie. Good. Heel. Nice, Louie. Nice. Louis, heel. Sit. Very good. Louis, heel. Good, Louis. Sit. Beautiful, Louis. Very good. Louis, heel. Very good. Sit. Very good. Very good. Good waiting, Lola. I'm sorry, but you have to wait. Good waiting. Here, eat these little crumbs. That's for you, Lola. That's for you, Louie. That's for you, Louie. Louie met a trainer with as much tenacity as he has. <laughs>
Louie, you met your match. No, it's true. I mean, a client comes here, and my commitment is, yes, your dog can learn to do these things. Louie, heel. Nice. Sit. Nice. Louie, heel. Very nice. Uh-oh. 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 Good, Louie. Good. Sit. Good, Louie. Louie, heel. Heel. Nice. Heel. Uh-oh. Heel. Good, Louie. Heel. Good, Louie. Good, Louie. That was a very nice turn. Good girl, Lola. Good girl, Lola. Louie, heel. Okay. I think we've hit our high point. Sit. Good. You know, and it was hard. It was a little hard. This was hard. This was not easy. Some dogs, you start this, and they're just, they're not as, uh, they don't have the springs in their feet that Louie and Lola have, and they would just start trotting easily. Really? This was hard. But I think the good thing in that is that, you know, no matter what, you just follow through, they're going to get there. It takes patience, good leadership, tenacity on my part. Really? We're going to get there. But I think he did a good job. So, yeah, typically the good news is they would never be as rough as they started out today. Whatever note you end on, that's exactly where you're going to begin on the next lesson. So I know with confidence that their owners, when they go to practice this indoors, they're going to start out right where I left off. <laughs>